What's up guys, Daryl Bourne back once again, clean at 99 Today guys, I want to talk a bit about arguments and how pointless they really are. And it's all about staying present, right? What I want to talk about guys, right, which I've learned over studying books, Louise Hay books, Wayne Dyer books, Abraham Hicks books, and how to retrain my mind and get connected to source and stay present, right? What I've learned about arguments, right? Two people come together to have an argument. Realistically, if you think about it, no one wins. Okay? It's two egos clashing together. No one wins, and it results in both people stressed out and releasing negative energy. They both go off and go, how did that person do that to me? Why, did, why didn't he agree with me? Why didn't he agree with me? Why didn't she agree with me? Right? All you do is come out of the argument with nothing but stress, nothing but negativity. Right? How I learned when someone comes up and be confrontational with me, how I learn to be present in that moment, right, is literally just staying still. Listen to what they say and say, look, that's an interesting point. I'll take that on board. And then just walk away. Because if you realise, if you actually argue back with that person, you're getting nowhere. Because it's two egos coming together. And the ego is not your true self. So what's going to happen is it's going to result in you saying stuff you don't want, want to say. That other person saying stuff they don't want to say. It may be two people not talking for a couple of days and that results in nothing okay so arguments are pointless it's all about spread and love guys okay i'm trying to help people out now from me transforming myself and for me studying books even some of my friends I remember one of my friends a couple of weeks ago had an argument with one guy in work and he was telling me and um, it resulted in nothing but them them two people not talking for two days okay because you got to realize Oh, the only thing that you can do is control yourself. That's the only thing you can do in life, guys, is control yourself, spread love, be grateful to people, appreciate people, show a bit of compassion. If that person doesn't want to appreciate you and doesn't want to be happy with you, that's fair enough. Let them be evil to you. That's their karma, you know what I mean? That's their karma. All you can do is spread love, you know what I mean? So when it comes to two people having an argument, it results in nothing. It results in two people going back, they go back into the negative uh, thinking program where they're stressed out, for a couple of days thinking why didn't that person not agree what I said and you've got to realise guys that everyone is independent everyone is on this world to co-create is to create their own life okay? so by arguing with each other that causes resist resistance that's all it does it causes resistance people don't agree with each other because of it. the whole point of this universe is for people to love each other and to be in cooperation and to get along it's not for two people to have an argument so when, even like you see stories guys say for instance where someone would do something with you and you talk to your friends about it and your friends tell you should go back to that person and give out and say listen would you do that for me? Do you ever do that? Do you ever go back to that person and your friends and then go back to that person and go would you do that for me? Think about what happens they just defend themselves and get offended and go would you do that for me? So it's resulting like I said you releasing this negative energy think about it if you go five days out and you get yourself with that friend and you can argue Think about how far I set you back. I set you back two, three days, one week, two weeks, back into the negative program, back away from your source, back from the true self, which is you, or you am. Positive, you know what I mean? To set you back. Rese releases negative energy, which you don't want to have. And that can be possible. It can be possible for you to be cooperating with everyone. For instance, um, I even know a person, right? Another friend of mine who just doesn't like to give money to people, he expects back straight away. Okay, you gotta realize, guys, when I give money, I don't expect it back. I don't want anyone to prove, I don't look for anyone to come back and say, Darry, thank you for giving me money. You know, no, that's yours. You know, I, I don't have to pay me back. That's what gratitude is all about, appreciation is all about. It's not about you have two weeks to pay me back, that okay, or else I'm gonna have a grudge against you. Holding resentments gets nowhere, guys. So, arguments is no good. Okay, there is a way of cooperating with everyone. And if you come up against a confrontational person, you gotta realize that person's dealing with problems in their own life. Nothing to do with you. It's a reflection of their own life. They're just out of touch with who they really are. They're negative, and they want to just take it out on you. And because you're in touch, and they see you're in touch, maybe they're trying to wobble you off the ball a bit, and they're trying to test you. You stay calm, stay present. You know, and just go. That's an interesting point. Okay, and. But not focusing attention, I always talk about attention, right? But not going and reacting when someone talks to you like, like that. Just slowly, okay, I'll take your, your point on board. Don't let their energy get into your mind because you've got to realise 
how things are actually process in the mind through the eyes through hearing you know everything that you see that you hear you process into the mind so do you realize if someone's attacking you and you let them get inside your mind and let their energy get inside your mind that's where negative thinking comes in that's where a process of a vicious circle of worrying anxiety fear you know stress comes from you don't need to argue with anyone guys just realize that there's no need if there is a confrontational person stay away from them and walk away thanks guys hope that helped no arguments no need for arguments you know what I mean? clean athlete 99 back once again